Hello believers, in this video we are going to talk about all the 12 new redeem code rewards in FC Mobile. Not only that, we will go through all these topics. 1. Latest FC Mobile leaks and updates. 2. 12 latest redeem codes in FC Mobile. So as always, the video will be very much informative and smash that subscribe button plus turn on the Thank notification you. bell icon for more informative contents like this. Now let's move to point number 1. Latest FC Mobile leaks and updates. There are a lot of latest FC mobile leaks in the recent scenario. So let's go to each and every update one by one. First, you all know well that this extra time pick pack is going to expire after 12 days, right? So a lot of you are asking me, will extra pick tokens be unusable after that? So if we read this instruction, then EA is saying clearly that extra time tokens will be no more usable. And this is really happy news because we might be getting some worthy rewards. Last time market pick was W pick pack event, after market pick pack. We got this extra pick which is totally scam and now on 21 November we may get new types of tokens and new pick pack event so this is going to be another hope which will give us more coins or higher OVR players like 102, 103. Let's see what happens next. Anyway my suggestion to everyone is to save your fodders since you can open pack instantly when the new pick event will come. Most possibly, the amount of tokens, chances to pack the different OVR players will also change. I am really not expecting 103 OVR players, but recently you can see in the untradeable pack, 103 OVR players have 2% chances to get packed, which is decent, but this time they might increase it and make it more packable. Now it's not confirmed yet if they will launch 104 and 105 OVR players in the new event. The new event is coming on the 22nd of November and is even going to be related to the Ballon d'Or. So, in case if they launch 104, 105 OVR players then, chances of getting 103 rating players will be easy. Anyway, I hope this time we will get some worthy packs instead of scam packs. Second information is regarding the UCL League phase. UCL League phase promo might come next week. You can expect Max Over to be 103, however, in case if Ballon d'Or will contain 104, 105 then, UCL League phase players might have feature of OVR upgraded due to which the might be upgraded 104, 105, but let's see what happens. Third information is about this streak pack. The total cost of this pack is unknown, however. Here you can see the rewards that you can get with the stream packs. It was launched by Sapurit. Again, as per Sapurit, soon we are going to get Cyber Week on December 2nd. It will have an 80% discount, which means it might be something packed, but it's not confirmed what it will cost to open, like gems, tokens, or FC points. Soon we are also going to get a lot of fodders from the showcase teams, which you can see here. Another information is related to POTM players. The voting of POTM is in process, and we could expect new POTM exchanges at the end of the November month. Last time, community reaction was very terrible against the POTM exchange, but still it's unchanged. Anyway, I hope this time EA will improve it. Another information is regarding Icon Chronicles, as you all know well file. Number 4 and 5 is released. Here are all the rewards that you are going to get from the file number 4 and 5. From both of the files, you can easily get 1.6k Universal Tokens, 2x98 rating players, 2x Mascherano, and 1x93 to 100 rating packs as higher rewards. Now, another week also, we are going to get another icon in the Icon Chronicles, and he is going to be Michael Owen. So if you are getting 1x Mascherano, OVR can be expected to be 98, 99, or 100. So let's see what happens. Now, let's move to point number 2. 12 latest redeem codes in FC Mobile. First, we have 6 redeem codes separately, and we are going to talk about those 6 redeem codes. First code is AKSO, which we have been listening to for a long time. Second code is related to a football clinic camp. The third code is related to the FC Pro Festival. All these three redeem codes are not confirmed when it will be released, and actually, what is the actual redeem code which can give you rewards? The fourth redeem code is related to Libertador's final fan zone. We might get a redeem code related to the final fan zone once the match between these two teams will be played on November 30th. This is the final match of the Libertadores. Another two redeem codes are not confirmed up to now, 
but EA mostly releases new redeem codes whenever they launch the new event, so you can definitely expect new redeem code in the upcoming two new events. First event is UCL League Stage. UCL League Stage might launch in mid-November, so let's see if EA will launch redeem code or not. Second is related to the new event Ballon d'Or, or Golden Ball. The name of the next event might be different, but the event is related to the Ballon d'Or. Anyway, that time also, we are going to get a new redeem code, which is related to that event. EA might give redeem code in the live stream, and live stream may happen on most probably 19 or the 20th of November. So stay tuned in our website or Discord server to get all the latest updates on redeem code. Now the next redeem code is Pepsi, and this has a total of maximum six promo codes which you can redeem. Before many of us were thinking Pepsi itself is a code, but it's not like that. Recently EA collaborated with Pepsi, and this is a very big collaboration. So, Pepsi is giving us promo codes. It's a random code which we can redeem through the Pepsi website. The promo code will be active from November 1st to February 2025. Now for those who will be late, they can definitely redeem code up to June 30th, 2025, but they must have code. Also, only with the age of 18 years old can enter redeem the promo code. Now talking about the reward, we are going to get rewards per pack. As I said, one account will be able to redeem six promo codes and that will give six different rewards. The first redeem can give a free 94 rated Sun Hung Min Ambassador card, untradeable. You can even see that card in the renders website. Also, you will get 65 plus over player items, 100k coins, 100 XP and version 1 Pepsi theme kit. If you try to redeem with the Pepsi promo code for a second time, then you can get almost similar rewards like in the pack one, but the kit will have another design. Now, performing redeem for the third, fourth, fifth, and sixth time, you can get similar rewards, but you are not getting kits of Pepsi in these rewards. All the rewards are similar, and trying to redeem for the six times will give you a 6x94 rating Sun Hyung Min card. Now let's know how to get code and how to redeem it. To redeem a code, you have to go to the official website of FC Mobile. Search pepsi.fcm.ea.com, and then you will get an option like you use to get in the normal EA Redeem website. You just have to sign into your account, fill CAPTCHA, and redeem the rewards. But I know well, a lot of you are searching for the redeem code, right? So to get redeem code, you have to buy Pepsi products. Like this type of can. If you buy it, you will get redeem code under the cap or inside the label. You just have to put that code in the site. One code is one-time use only. I mean, one code can be used in one account only, so they did this stuff to increase the purchase of the Pepsi drinks. Honestly, the reward they are giving to us is really unworthy of buying the Pepsi products. You have to visit local shops, look upon the Pepsi cans, and see whether FC Mobile is written. If FC Mobile is written in the bottle, then you can definitely get code for sure. And after that, come to the site and redeem the reward. After that much hard work wasting money, you just get a 94 rating 6X card. Other rewards are just useless. And that 6X cards is also almost useless because with the 6X94 rating card, you can only perform extra pick exchange, which contains 250 to 350 tokens. In case if you get all the time, maximum 350 tokens also in 6. Try with the 94 rating card, you will be able to get only 2.1k tokens, which is ridiculous. Literally 2.1k tokens is not giving you anything in case if you multiply 2.1k tokens by 6 then, it will be around 12k tokens. So if they have given us 6x better rewards then, it was valid to open this 12.5k extra pick pack, which could give at least something around 15 million coins. So the reward that you are getting is 15 divided by 6 equals 2.5 million value. And for 2.5 million coins, you are going to shop doing such a useless thing. Sit home, drink water, not the Pepsi. Top up in game instead of doing these sheets. You are wasting money, health, and your time, which is the most essential thing in your life. Ha ha ha, seriously. Like for doing that much things, they are giving us forking 2.5 million coins. That's forking Ridicilius and L. That's not even equal to opening this 3K gems pack. I opened this 3K gems pack. Just look at this. I got 99 rating players, and with that 99 rating player, I got 2.4K tokens minimum for sure. They are just breaking their limits and doing useless things. 
I am fine with the collab, but when it comes to fair rewards, they really lack it over and over again. Last time they did the same in the market pick exchange, they did the same in this POTM exchange, and now they want money in doing it with the brand collab. If you are my fan, boycott this. Anyway, I hope at least you got some relief with my words as the stupidity EA has been doing for the last one to two months is really not valid. So, that's all for today's video, and for regular content like this, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell icon. I will meet you with another one. Till then, your lovely host, Mr. Believer, signing out.